Uh, today I will show you how to draw in uh, AutoCAD, how to make drawings in AutoCAD uh, using input in Excel VBA. So first uh, today I will show you uh, how to give input in uh, Excel so that uh, your drawings are created in AutoCAD. So I opened my AutoCAD and this is Excel sheet where I am giving input. So here we have to give length, depth and uh, breadth of beam and what cover we are using and beams are divided into two parts, mid and end. So the reinforcement at the mid, number of top bar, number of bottom bars, top bar diameter and bottom bar <laughs> diameter and end are uh, similar. So we have to give the uh, bar details and then the stirrups spacing certain spacing at what spacing you need and the beam id what id we prefer and step of diameter and column width because beam will be spanning between the columns generally so for making the drawings we need to know what is the uh, column width on both sides of the beam okay so these are all autocad setting uh, still it is in under development so still we can make a lot of customization in this okay so i open my autocad Okay. Yeah, it is helpful not for creating structural drawings, but at least to give input to your detailers so they can start working, you can save time and if it is some minor jobs, you can use this drawing for editing purpose. and all the drawings will be to scale. So let me draw uh, reinforcement detail section views started uh, drawing all the views as you can see still we can add uh, a lot more details uh, like stirrup so dia and other callouts uh, so which i will try to include in next upcoming version So it can create like as many as thousand or whatever the number you give. So there is no limit for uh, Excel sheet to draw. So now I will uh, click uh, uh, drop beam longitudinal section. So I will uh, and it will start drafting the section views. As you can see here, even the length of the beam or everything that you can control in the text height and what is the spacing of the stirrups so here i have not uh, done colored for the uh, main reinforcement beams top and bottom so which i will try to include in the next uh, version which i am going to update later yeah, try to use this Excel sheet and uh, share your feedback and please subscribe. To make uh, VBA to work, you need to install uh, AutoCAD VBA enabler, so which is available in AutoCAD uh, Autodesk website. Uh, it is, so you can download for free and you can install. So with this, you, can, you are connecting, there is a bridge between your Excel as well as the AutoCAD. Yeah, this is a code which I have written.